Some farmers in Agbazu, a community in the South municipality of the Greater Accra region, say sun winning activities are destroying their farms. Last week, a court bailiff who was sent to the area following an injunction application filed by some farmers over a seven 750-acre land was allegedly assaulted in the presence of a police officer who was escorting him, putting fear in the farmers. My colleague Calvis Tete has more in the following report. This is Agbazo, a farming community in the Gasaud municipality of the Greater Accra region. Interestingly, in the Greater Accra region, this community and a few other areas are among the few places where farmlands could be found. But unfortunately, farmers have had to struggle with sand winners. In one instance, a court bailiff from the Accra High Court was sent to the area following an injunction application filed by some farmers whose 750 acre land had been destroyed, was reportedly physically assaulted. The farmers say the sand winners sometimes go to the extent of firing shot to scare them away from their own land, thus putting fear in them. According to some angry farmers, the situation makes it difficult for them to work on their own farms. They lament that this is negatively affecting their farming business as they can no longer work long hours on their farm for fear of being attacked. Efforts to get the municipal assembly to take action has yielded no results. Some farmers lament the daily struggles they go through at the hands of sun winners who are themselves land guards. Uh, we try to solve the problem through the police. We arrest three machines. The third day, the machines came back again and they are working up to now. At the moment, we have 10 hectares, which is under cultivation, which is cassava, maize, potato. And they have invaded the land and they are spoiling all the crops on the land. If you guess there now, you see plenty of langas on the foot. They are working now, at the moment, they are working with eight machines. If you go to the distance, we don't hear anything. They only tell you it's order from above. Uh, the place is coming very scary. At dawn, we heard them boom, boom, boom at the place. Warning shot, yes. In the morning when we wake up, they have invaded the place with uh, their machines and everything. And it becomes very scary for us living in the place. You can't go out at, from foregoing. Osman Kadri is the 2021 Greater Accra Regional Best Farmer and the District Best Farmer on three consecutive occasions. He has intentions of vying for the National Best Farmer Award this year. But unfortunately for him, his farm has been destroyed by these sand winners. He says the sand winners encroached on his farmland without authorization, leading to the destruction of over 700 acres of maize and 50 acres of watermelon. His plan of vying for the National Best Farmer Award for 2024 are in limbo as the situation he finds himself in does not make him the preferred candidate. We call here a petition. It is our Accra region. Yeah, the yeah, the number could do about five thirty to six by seven o'clock. And yes, I just mean you know. Yeah, this is a normal say order from Abef. My dear, we will be five hundred acres. We will water melon be seventeen acres. We will enkuma be twenty acres. We will trawa be five acres. And so now we will potato be ten acres. You know, we will to you know. The chief of Yahoma who is the custodian of the land, says several efforts they have put in place to stop the sand winning activities have fallen on deaf ears. Some farmers in Agbazo, a community within the Obum enclave, are worried for their safety. This is as a result of land guards who are winning sand within this enclave. Farmers have been left with no option than to run for their lives. These farmers are calling for government support to, to sack these land guards who are constantly destroying their lands. Carvestete, Channel One News, Agbazo.